Good afternoon, Burleson Heavenist Church. Wow, uh, we are living in unprecedented times, that's for sure. This whole outbreak, um, I don't know, things are just changing so rapidly, it's unbelievable. I, I hope that you're getting the midweek emails. Um, as, as we work through this hiatus of being separated, it's more important now than ever that we're able to stay in contact with each other. And so those midweek emails are just so crucial. If you're not getting them, please reach out to Pastor Orland or myself or Liz, call the office at the church so that we can get you added to the list so you can get that information because we really, right now, we really need to stay connected as we're being forced apart. And speaking of being forced apart, I was in a uh, teleconference uh, meeting yesterday with the Texas Conference and by <clears throat> NAD um, suggestion, uh, it didn't sound like a suggestion, mandate uh, and the Texas Conference, they're asking that all schools and churches close all on-site activities for the next 30 days. So this separation is going to be a little bit more than the two weeks we had originally thought about, which again makes communicating and staying connected that much more important because while we're separated it's imperative that we all know we're all still here for each other if there's anything that you need any help if you're short on supplies if you know whatever it might be please reach out to me pastor orland uh steve thompson any of the elders uh, call the office speak to liz because we are here and we're going to make sure that we're still a family helping each other through this unbelievable crisis uh, we have taken some measures <clears throat> that we want you to know about to stay to, to stay connected to maintain that communication obviously the midweek email which you should be getting on every wednesday and probably more emails than that um, also the website is an important tool right now we have uh, created a separate page dedicated to this covid 19 uh, outbreak uh, we have links to the cdc we have links to the city of Burleson. We have NED and Texas Conference links. Uh, on that page, we're also going to have links for family activities. We've got uh, the church service, adult Sabbath school, a children's Sabbath school that will be linked there. And all of that is in one location on that connect tab on our website, which is www.burlesonadventist.com. And so you can get all of that information right there. And we want you to. Because again, we need to stay connected. But there's also going to be a link to uh, Adventist Online Giving. Uh, there will be a video in the midweek email that has uh, directions on how to uh, go about setting up an online giving account if you aren't already doing it. Uh, stewardship is so important. It's part of our, our walk with God. And believing and, and having faith and, and trust in Him providing through this this is an important time to exercise that faith that we have in God and what he's going to do to carry us through. He's a big God. We know that. And you know what? And I wanted to just kind of end this video uh, reminding you of the peace that Jesus wants for us. In, in John chapter 16, Jesus spends quite a bit of time talking to his disciples, telling them what they can expect in the coming days of his crucifixion and resurrection. And he tells them how they're going to be scattered, how they're going to be scared, how there's going to be turmoil and, and fear. And he shares all of this with them. He shares how he'll, he'll leave, but he'll come again. And he, he shares all of that for one simple reason. Jesus wants them to have peace. He wants them to have assurance, knowing that he's still in control, that, it's, that he's on the throne, that he's, that he's not leaving forever, that he's right there with them throughout this whole ordeal. And I just want to share that verse with you. It's in John chapter 16, 33, where Jesus says it best. He says, I have told you all this so that you may have peace in me. Here on earth, you will have many trials and sorrows, but take heart, church, because I have overcome the world. That is our Lord and our Savior. And there is peace in Jesus even now amidst this uncertainty. And I just want to invite you. If you're feeling discouraged, if you're feeling fearful, if you're feeling unnerved, please don't hesitate to reach out to one of the elders, Pastor Orland Liz. Please reach out to me. We would love to spend some time encouraging you, praying with you, listening to you, hearing you, and just lifting you up to the, to the throne of mercy and grace. We have a great big God church, and even though it may not seem like it, he is still in control. So we'll be talking again shortly. We'll have another video, maybe tomorrow, from Pastor Orland. I'll be sending another one out on Friday about church 
on Sabbath. So we'll be talking again soon. Have a blessed day. Jesus loves you, and so do I. All right. Bye-bye.